How to save a clip in Max Pro in VR. From the Max Pro NVR Viewer tab, use your mouse to select a camera you would like to make a clip for on the left hand device tree. Toward the bottom of your screen, you will see a small button with an up arrow. Press that button to display the video timeline options. Across the center of this menu is the video recording timeline information. It shows the time and type of recording the NVR has stored for this particular camera. There is a color key beneath the timeline to show you what each type of recording is called. You can use the center scroll wheel of your mouse to zoom in and out of the timeline to narrow your time frame down to the minute. If you hover your mouse over the timeline, it will show you the date and time to the millisecond on where you are in the timeline if you were to click it. Once you have a good starting time in mind, click that spot on the timeline with your left mouse button, then select the mark in bracket here on the left. You will see the bracket is now placed on the timeline. Repeat this same step for your mark out time. Once you have a time frame marked, as you see here, select the timeline tool that looks like the CD within the folder to the left. This will display the clip creation dialog. In the streams section here, you will see the name it has assigned my clip, and by default, the clip format it will create is the Windows Media Video Format, or WMV. You also have options for ASF and the Max Pro MPVC format as well. The notes below this section explain in what scenarios you might want to use each format. In the output section, you have options to change the job name, the clip creation path, and any comments you'd like to embed with the video as well. The archive and digitally sign option will create a container package for your video file and will digitally sign the clip to ensure that the video has not been tampered with. The Include MPVC Clip Player option, which is grayed out here because I'm not using the MPVC format at the moment, allows you to choose if you would like to include a portable clip player along with your MPVC video file for ease of playback of the proprietary format. Once you have made your selections, press OK and you will be taken back to the Live View window. In the bottom toolbar of Max Pro, you should see a spinning wheel next to the clip export text as seen here. If you click that button, you can see the current status of any clips that are currently being encoded and created. This window will show you the current status of your clip and the percentage of its completion. Once the clip is completed, you can navigate to the directory you set in the clip creation window and find your video file available for viewing outside of the Max Pro NVR software. For more great tips and interactive training, visit HoneywellDiscoverTraining.com. And thank you for choosing Honeywell.